security research uh, is a priority for the EU, it is a priority for the uh, member states as well, and um, the uh, geopolitical context is reminding uh, us of that. It is therefore very important and through the hub to uh, fund research that will work for our future security. The hub has a key role to play uh, and therefore a key societal impact in um, driving that research in the, in the areas where it matters most and uh, where it can bring uh, most of the operational impact and of course in full compliance with fundamental rights and our EU values. And we are here in Innovation Hub to bring together practitioners, researchers, innovators, but also very practical uh, officers from the law enforcement to gain information on the new tools available and to put them into practice. The EU Innovation Hub value is in the last part, in the hub, being the uh, centre of knowledge, being able to draw expertise, know-how from academia, member state, agency, commission. What is really cool about the hub is uh, that people, what they get an output products, uh, these products, uh, they benefited from the richness of the expertise that is in the room and one roof in the Innovation Hub. I think it's very important to have a body that guarantees that all the efforts made at European or national level are coordinated so that the LEA can stay abreast with the challenges the societies are facing. We have a great diversity of profile in the Hub and we have to work together and to develop this uh, team spirit. This is exactly what we would like to achieve uh, today with this conference and in the coming months, of course, collaborating together in order to innovate. It is important that uh, we do not prevent first responders, law enforcement and border guards to, to use AI, but we need to enable them to use it uh, responsibly. Artificial intelligence should be at the center of our uh, research uh, and we need to do that in compliance with what already has been a uh, few years ago regulated by the Commission, so in terms of ethical approach, in terms of transparency, in terms of data protection. We need first to test them somewhere, uh, to have a sounding board, so that eventually when we put them in a practice they can work out effectively.